during my time, uh, unfortunately, I, I wasn't able to attend any kindergarten. My parents were, were not able to send me or uh, afford to send me to kindergartens. But looking at the children here this morning and the proud parents who are all here, uh, there's many reasons to be proud of them. You can see how confident, how selfish, how articulate, and how talented they all are. And for that, I'm sure you'll join me in also thanking the, all the teachers uh, who have given off their time, their effort uh, to teach them and teach them well. Today, it marks the graduation of the children from kindergarten and into formal school. But I'm sure that the lessons that they have learned in their time here are no less valuable than the, the ones they will learn in primary school. For one, they learned about love, they learned about compassion. As you heard, and you know, last year, children from the kindergarten, from Saranga Kidakar, they raised a thousand dollars to the auction of their own paintings and artworks, which they subsequently donated to children with disabilities. This year, the K2 students, their t-shirt auction, raised almost $5,500. And parents from the K1, the nursery, and the Teachers and Parents Association of Sarada also contributed generously. So as a result, collectively, the Sarada in the garden raised $7,500 for the Society for Physical Disability. Teachers, staff, and parent volunteers support the Society for the Physically Disabled I Accept campaign by wearing the SPD button. Many are wearing them today. The I Accept campaign has also been discussed with the K2 children and as a result, they have a better understanding and acceptance of people with disability. The kindergarten has come a long way since it started in 1993 in the multi-purpose Sarada Hall with a student population of 12610. Today it has grown not one time but multiple times and now there are some 505 students. This year 167 of them will graduate and they will go into a more formal, more structured environment and they will learn more. One thing I would have, uh, want to leave all the parents with is that I think we need to guard against, uh, and this is directed at parents, because I find that competition in schools may sometimes lead to cramming, hectoring, and pot housing by parents. And these may lead to children who become miserable, who may not like school, and who may regard tests and exams as things to be feared. It is good that these K2 children come from a school which has as its main philosophy small groups and holistic learning. More importantly, I admire the kindergarten's efforts to cater to the talents and gifts of each child, giving him and her the confidence, the peace of mind to learn in their own ways. A big thank you also goes to all the children, all the teachers for imbuing these values and lessons to the children. I hope these values will stay with the children as they continue <laughs> to grow. Before I end, I want to thank the President again for his kind words and support. And I certainly want to congratulate all the young graduates today. I wish them a bright future and I know they will have a great future because of the things they have learned in this school. And on that note, I wish everyone a pleasant day. Thank you.